Are you, are you sticking something in my hood? What? I don't remember about now. Eddie, is there a banana peel in my hood? I mean, I wouldn't say there isn't a banana peel in your hood. Okay. Okay. What's up guys? We are at Commando Temple Gym here in London. It is, um, was a little bit of a journey for us to get here, but we had some more time today, thankfully. And they have more uh, strongman stuff. And actually walking in here, this place has a lot of fun toys. Uh, one of which happens to be a uh, Thomas Ench dumbbell. And then this is a Millennium dumbbell. So that uh, is 106 kilos. I believe it's 231 pounds. Uh, yeah, if that math is right, 231 pounds, I believe. That it's, so it's the same handle as a Thomas Inch dumbbell. Thomas Inch is 172 pounds. Already an incredible feat of strength to pick that up. So to do a Millennium dumbbell, I actually don't know how many guys uh, in the world have ever lifted a Millennium dumbbell, but I feel pretty comfortable saying it's less than 10 uh, in history. So that is really exciting. Was not planning on seeing that today and they've got a variety of different, uh, different grip tools and uh, strongman implements. So really a pretty cool setting. Uh, main goal today is to uh, work on a little bit of conditioning for World's Strongest Man uh, for me. We still don't know the events, um, which makes the training hard but um, I'm just kind of going off of what we had last year and they threw in a little bit more moving some lighter events so I'm going to try to prep for that a little bit. You alright? You good? Mm -hmm. Dren. I'm just waking up. Okay. <laughs> and one other fun thing before we go. They uh, somehow managed to get a statue of Eddie Hall uh, and put it right in the chalk bowl here. So I mean, that is one good-looking gorilla, I'll be honest. <laughs> it, is, it is actually pretty cool. Pretty cool, but uh, anyway. Yeah, I, I really like this place. So we're going to get warmed up, get after it, uh, and uh, get some quality work in. I mean, it's, it's a little bit disturbing how that's the first thing you think of. Oh. And then, after saying that, put it right on your face. <laughs> I just don't know what to say about that. Oh, I know. You, did you hear is that safe hanging on? What is it? Uh, it's safe. It is safe? No, definitely not. Is it safe to hang on? Is this yeah. alright to hang on? No. Yeah, it's got it's 90 degrees at the top and it's bolted in at the top. No, no, no. No, no yeah. <sighs> How do you feel about that? You're too fat to hang on the bar. You hang on it. I, well, if you're too fat, what, what are you trying to say, man? Well, you are much fatter than me. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm actually uh, heavier, but lower body fat percentage in the head. So. Keep, just keep telling yourself that, buddy, because no one believes it. So, oh. even though it's factual. No. <laughs> I don't know if you heard, but I'm 20.1% 20, 20 45 right now. So it went from 20 to 21, <laughs> but it's actually 22 and a half. 20.1. No, it's good. That's good. All right. Oh, yeah. Here's one. One sandbag, one barrel, and then that one is one. one yeah, we'll that. <laughs> okay. Well, that's the heaviest one, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. No, I'll start, I'll start with the sandbag.
positions. Up and ready. Go. Go. you try to beat that and I'll try to beat you. Okay. Back and forth. Yeah. Just keep improving a little bit. It's okay. Pick it. Just pick up the pace. And then maybe we'll figure out. Probably add the fifth one. Add, I was going to say maybe add something to go just a touch longer yeah. on the time. But yeah, it feels, I mean, this is great. I mean, it's, uh, I definitely feel sore. But it's really, it's really, I can tell it's one of those things that's going to be really good when I'm done. Because it's just my body needs to move right now. So. Okay. Good. You need some chocolate. Six. Right, cool. Good, good, right. So we time on phone, and then we'll compete with each other a bit. Then we can increase it each time we go. Yeah, so that's a good idea. I think we'll have a good way of measuring that thing and, and bump it up just for speed. Okay. Ready? Go. this it's not really about the weight yeah. because I would prefer a heavy just really hard yeah but for myself where I feel like I fell down was the speed yeah because I'm stronger footwork but it's just if they're gonna make these things lighter yeah. I have to be faster to keep up with yeah. the lighter faster guys you know yeah. oh. Oh. all right easy work Let's get it done. Let's get it done. Absolutely ready. Take your position. Set. Go. Good. Two seventy-five. Go ahead, go ahead. It's a good run. Go oh boy. Let's work. Okay. Uh, Brian, twenty-two point seven five to beat buddy. Good, good time. It might be the fastest I've ever seen you move. Well, the fastest I've ever seen you move is when the buffet opens up. <laughs> I'm not going to even argue with you. You're always the first in the buffet line. <laughs> <laughs> 
If I'm hungry and it opens, I'm there. Yeah, 100%. Right. Let's get this done. Oh. Athletes, take the positions. Athletes, ready? Yeah. Ready? That was actually good though. Because that would happen in a contest. Of course it would, yeah. So, of course it would. Or it could happen. Hopefully it doesn't, but it could. That was great. We just did, yeah. But as soon as I or you finish, one of us finishes down here, we'll pull that keg down and put it right here. Okay? And then we'll have a full one. But what we'll have to be quick is you'll finish that. We'll have to get that down and out of the way while the other guy's getting this one. And then come down and grab that one and bring it back. So, so six. But oh, the kegs are full lengths at the end. Okay, so if we did the barrels first and then the sandbags last, that gives me time to get the barrels down. Done. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Have it ready. Set. Go. Thirty nine point nine. Ah you need a you stumbled both ends with those last two barrels and you hesitated whether to go or not. Yeah. So, so I also got caught up in the middle. I stepped on the handle. <laughs> you stepped on the handle yes. and ripped it. I was off. trying to rip. <laughs> <laughs> And I was like, why is this thing not coming? <laughs> I didn't see that. Yeah. I didn't see that. I put my foot right on my foot. And I was like, nope. And then I had to rip the handle off to keep going. Well, let's take, let's take a second off for that. 38. It's still good. I mean, yeah, it's good. It's fast. That was a good, uh, good challenge, man. Eddie's speed has improved a lot since, uh, since he slowed down, he's quick. He is quick. I'll give him that. That was a lot of fun, man. I mean, good, good job, buddy. This is something. Again, I say this all the all the time, but this is a, a day where we had some time. We had to do some really heavy stuff for the uh, show yesterday. Really heavy. Can't say what, but it was ridiculous. And uh, I, I said to Ed, I was like, "Yeah, I need to go get some loading training in, move around a little bit." 
He's the first guy to jump up and say, yeah, man, I'll go do it. He's not getting ready for any contest and easily could have just rested and let me come do this by myself. But I know I got better today because he came in because that made me push and having a time to beat is always a good thing. So uh, anyway, what do you think? Time for some grip or what? Yeah, yeah let's have some grip. Let's get that bad boy out. Let's start with the, do you want to start with the biggest one first so we don't get tired? Yeah, I mean, I, and then work our way down to the same. Have you ever, you've lifted an inch dumbbell though? I've done an inch. I've done yeah. 120, 126 kilo with a one and a quarter inch handle okay. to my knee. And this is, this is uh, well, that's a two almost, it's a two inch handle. Almost two and a half. Is it? Well, the, the original was 2.47 inches. Right. So it's a little bit thicker. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Quite a bit. Even with two arms, that's ridiculous. So what do we got? Millennium dumbbell <laughs> replica, one-handed lift. So has somebody done this already? Is this what's, what's Millennium? Is that a guy or a person? Or? I actually, I hate to say this, but I actually don't know where the Millennium dumbbell name came from. Uh, I know that that for me, I, I think there's only, I think there's honestly only a handful of these dumbbells in the world. Yeah. Like total. So the inch dumbbells, those got actually fabricated and, and made into a mold that was sold. So there's a lot more of those around than these. Yeah. And I don't know actually, I think they might have been made over here in the UK. Because um, I think in, in the United States there's only one of them, maybe or two. But I've done, um, Ode Haugen, I don't know if he owned it or not. I don't think he did. But for some reason, the guy that had it in the States had it at his gym. Right. And I lifted it. But this is a long time ago, yeah. right? And I don't think at the time I even understood how impressive it was. But, no, you know. yeah, this is, this is I mean, to, ex to explain to you guys how impressive this is, this is kind of like a uh, sword in the stone type of lift where almost everybody in the world could try and it's not going to budge it's not going to move and there's a very very limited maybe less than five people in the entire world that could make this leave the ground so i don't know for sure i'd have to do a lot of research to figure out the names that have actually lifted this so if i'm saying five and i'm incorrect i'm sorry to anybody that actually has done it but i know of only a couple that have actually broke this off the ground. So, so what weight's this? So this is, they, I think they said that you gave me 106 kilos. So it may, I said 231 pounds, but 105 kilos is 231 pounds. So okay. it may be, something like that. It's either 231 or maybe 235. Okay, doing that. But uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's the same handle as an inch dumbbell. So to get the concept of how heavy that is, yeah. you know, you guys have seen guys come to my gym and try to lift the Thomas Inch dumbbell. That's the ones that I have replicas like 175, 176 pounds. The original is 172 pounds. So you're talking like, what is that? Basically 60 pounds, yeah, 60 pounds heavier with the same handle. And the globes are bigger, which means that the rotation yeah, will, be, will more. be more. So. The, I mean, I'm, I'm talking a lot, but I just want you to understand the magnitude of how hard this actually is. It's not a, it's not a little walk in the park type lift like you just casually do. Oh, I'm gonna keep talking about it, you're gonna do it. I, I, think that, I think that you need to do it. Okay. Here, let me get in my chocolate there. All right, come on in. Yeah, just like that. Oh, 
full minute. It's 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 that rotation that's the problem. Yeah. Come on then, Brian, you're up. Okay. You hear that? Yeah. That's where I want to get out of there. Right, I got you. I've never had that before. No? Yeah, it's just that. It's just the weight of it. So it just really rolls my fingers open instantly. It's very, I mean, it's it's crazy too, because I actually think, uh, I don't know how you feel, but I think the handle's a little bit longer. See, my arm's gone now. Is it? Yeah, it's not trying so hard on that. Yeah. I mean, I, I know I've got a good grip, but I can't do it. Let's go, Brian. Yeah, grip's gone now. Yeah, you've done it four, four times. Yeah, it's, it's amazing. It just, it's, it's a... It's one of those things you don't... I don't think even watching it... You don't appreciate how difficult that, that's soft. That's that hard. That's really hard. I mean, it's just a different level of. I mean, to me, to me, this is easy. Like, and, and a lot of people wouldn't say that, but you it's can like see that. Yeah. I could do that. I've done that at an expo where I was in a booth. Yeah. For two days straight, literally hundreds of times. Yeah. And I mean, this is three or four times, and I'm like, done. done. I'm shot. And I could just go back and forth, back and forth. So the, the level of this one is yeah. moon and stars. Like 25 kilos heavier than that one? That's crazy. Right? Yeah. I think almost yeah. third. Well, th 60. 60. Like, that's 78. 78 kilos. Yeah. Not 100, 106. 106. Yeah. 30. Yeah. 30. Just about. Just right? 28 kilos heavier. Yeah. That's nuts. That's a lot. All right, guys. Well, um, I think we have uh, taken up enough of the gym's time. They've been nice enough to stay open for us to get some training in and obviously have some 
like crazy awesome uh, grip stuff here uh, that we got to play with a little bit. I could probably spend an entire day in that section messing with things, but uh, we need to go eat. We need to get out of here uh, and um, go get into uh, trouble somewhere else. Yeah. So for now, go out and be great, and we'll check you guys later. Mm -hmm.